So since 2013, I'm using the ceramic implants in my daily practice. And on the beginning, it was just for the single replacement in a high aesthetic area and in a patient with a high risk aesthetic request. But um, in the last few years, we had a lot of patients who are coming with a recorded hypersensitivity on the metal, like titanium. So in the last three years, I had, a, I had like for, for example, four patients with an with a allergy on the titanium, hypersensitivity, and that was one of the indications for using of ceramic implants. Especially today, when we have the two pieces implants, indications are a lot, and I'm really, my feedback to the ceramic Strauman uh, pure implant is perfect. So I would like first to tell you the benefits of the both of them. The benefit is first the color shade, which is giving the more natural look. Then the benefit is material, which is um, zirconium dioxide, which is getting definitely more physical characteristic, like more density, more strength, more elastic than titanium. And on the end, the surface, which is providing the perfect also integration, even the healing after the six weeks. If you go to the, like for example, the benefit of the monotype, then in that case, we have like a drawing of the gap between the abutment and the implant. And if you go to the advantages of the two pieces, it's giving the more flexible option in the prosthetic area. So we have now the huge possibility for the indications and definitely providing the great aesthetic. Yeah, definitely it is a very interesting question because the, most of us are interested in these results about the peri implant tissue. So the, the, these are not recent researches. Like for example, two de decades ago, we had a lot of researches telling about the OS integration of the zirconium uh, dioxide surface. But today, like 2014 and until the today, we have the new researches telling about the less plaque accumulation, less bacterial adhesion on the surface of zirconium dioxide, which is resulting in the, like we can call irritation-free peri-implant soft tissue. So that means the less inflammation, then you can use the zirconium dioxide surface implants in a situation when you have the history of the periodontal disease. It was also noticed that uh, less recession of the gingiva is present here. In 2016, I also published one clinical research comparing the plaque accumulation on zirconium dioxide and the titanium, and the results were significantly less in the zirconium dioxide. So absolutely, that is a surface which is providing better peri-implant tissue healing. First, I will tell you that uh, for me, the biggest advantage is, is having the two options, monotype and two pieces. I'm actually a fan of the two pieces. And there, there is not so many implant systems which is offering the two pieces implant system. Then uh, the second, which can be benefit for the Strauman Pure is the surface. So we have the ZLA surface, comparing to the, some other companies which has a laser uh, uh, surface, or for example, Ceralog, which has a B textural surface, which is uh, like ceramic injected modeling surface. So definitely these are all things which are giving the benefits to the Strauman Pure comparing to the other implant systems. So it's, like, it's quite difficult telling something against the titanium because the titanium developed the, the um, um, implant dentistry. But anyway, I think the metal-free implant dentistry is the future and regarding that there is more requests from the patient side and also uh, the possibility to avoid all or, uh, or disadvantages of the titanium, I believe that ceramic implants is the future and uh, it will be the zirconium dioxide will be the leader material in the implant dentistry in the future. Also very interesting that uh, ceramic implants are also the topics of the many dental conferences, at least one lecture or more sessions are present on the different conferences. I'm so proud that on the 16th of the February, I will be the speaker on the 8th World Conference of International Academy of Ceramic Implants, the whole conference which will have only one topic, and that is a metal-free implant dentistry.